What's up, you guys? It's Matt here. So I kind of want to take you guys through a journey because um, I'm getting some some comments on Twitter and YouTube of people asking me, hey, you know, I'm just getting into Terra Luna Classic now and I don't understand how you got, you know, 40 or you spent $40 and bought 63 million. Well, as far as I knew, I thought I bought it on stream, but for some reason I cannot find it. I don't know if it was on my Twitch stream because I was doing Twitch streams at the time. I was doing, you know, YouTube and Twitch. So I ended up buying it, but I have a gap, right? To where I bought uh, some at a certain point, um, profited off of that at, a, at that certain point, but then saw it at these low levels. And literally you have a gap from where I had a certain amount. And then all of a sudden, I'm now at a way higher amount and profiting off of the different moves that I've made. So it's kind of it's kind of hard to follow if you are looking for the actual live streams because I can't really find them, but you do have a bunch of videos seeing the progression and how, you know, making these moves and kind of timing it the right way um, really did work out for me the right way. So I wanted to kind of take you through this, this journey here while Terra Luna Classic is sort of making moves right now, depending on where you see um, or what happens with Terra Luna Classic throughout the day. I don't know what will happen because this is uh, being recorded early in the morning at 8.48 uh, a.m. But yeah, I wanted to take you through a little bit of a journey just to give you an understanding of kind of where I uh, came from here with Terra Luna Classic. So guys, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell for more videos like this one. Also, make sure you guys check out some of the links down below. It does help out the channel. And if you guys want to follow me on Twitter at Perry8K, you can follow me over there. Don't forget about my Patreon. The link is in the description for my Patreon. If you guys want to check that out um, and, you know, follow me over there and, um, you know, get some different educational content and buy alerts whenever I'm making a buy, whenever I'm making a sell, you'll get those alerts as well um, and different stuff uh, here and there. But Let's talk about Terra Luna Classic a little bit. So as you know, uh, if we go into um, you know my Terra Station or Station Wallet, you're going to see I have eight thousand eight hundred fifty-four dollars and ninety cents. That's about forty-six or forty-seven million coins. Now I do have some that's over in KuCoin, so I have about fifty something. I can't remember exactly how much it is, but fifty something. I think it's like fifty-two um, million, fifty-four million, something like that. Um, and either way, that doesn't really matter. What matters is where I came from from the start. Because what I preach all the time is how I turned $40 into $30,000. And I bought at a very low low. That's kind of unbelievable because when you look at some of these exchanges, the lowest low that you can see is like four zeros or five zeros sometimes. And people are questioning like whether I actually made this move, whether I'm actually investing only $40. And the answer is yes. I tried to find everything on the blockchain, but it's not really breaking things down the right way because it was bought through pancake swap rather than bought or swap through um, MetaMask itself. So it was a little bit tricky of a situation. So it brings up like hot wallet or something like that. But I did make the purchase through there and you're going to see it was about $43 plus fee. It was about $44 in total that I could bring up. So literally, um, I've been searching through a bunch of different things here to try and figure out um, which one it was because it was either on the 12th or the 13th. So I wanted to also look up YouTube to see if I purchased it live on stream because I thought that I did. But here uh, should be the purchase right here, which does say transfer uh, $44.15. Now, these are swaps beforehand where I did buy a lower amount at a higher price. And I'll show you exactly what I did there and show you the actual buy because I was I didn't know if I was risking showing anything. So I didn't want to show any of that detail. But you do have those swaps to where I did buy Terra Luna Classic before that $40 point, but profited off of it and then ended up buying my major amount when it did hit a low price. So if we bring this back, we go back to YouTube, right? This is where it all happened, right? I'm um, going by views and whatever happened within this, uh, you know, a couple of days, right? We saw a decent increase in, in these days because there was a lot of uh, hype around Terra Luna Classic. And you can see I was the first one to really mention it um was talking about how the crypto market was bloody um and then as i got here i talked about terra luna classic in my live stream i talked about terra luna classic here could be the end of terra luna classic when you got into these videos the price was around uh, a dollar or two so it was definitely at a lower price than where you saw but it wasn't at the lowest price that it was so then you go into may 12th this is where it started to show you 
uh, different different uh, prices here. Now it still was at like pennies, I believe. You know, and um, it wasn't at uh, you know fractions of pennies, so like fifty percent of a penny, ten percent of a penny, anything like that. And you're gonna see that in some of these videos here. Like as I go into, let's say, one of these videos, and just click into one of these videos here. And uh, I don't want to play anything, but I do want to show you what the price was. It was at two cents. You know, two point six cents that it was there. Um, but then we got into another one where I believe this was. Uh, on no, this was afterwards because I had a gap. So uh, if I go here, we're gonna see there was another gap. So you saw the gaining three hundred dollars or turning three hundred dollars into thir uh, three thousand or turning forty dollars into six thousand. There was that gap. So the three hundred dollars that I spent from the beginning, I took that profit. And throughout this video, I kind of explained exactly what I would normally do. Now let me go ahead and move my to head where really quick. So I would take see it. the three hundred dollars that I invested and turn it into, you know, $2,400, $3,000 or so to where I did end up taking $300 profit at that moment. So once I took that $300 profit, I was at a break even. <clears throat> Everything I believe started to come back a little bit. I was actually at a, a net positive when I took that money. Um, but then I invested the $40 into it, which again, you do have a gap. I thought that I was live streaming, but I guess I wasn't. Maybe I was, oh, you know what? I think I was live streaming on Patreon at the time because I was doing separate Patreon live streams. Yes, I think that was it. So if I find it, I'll, I'll find a way to, to show you guys. But I was doing a Patreon live stream for members only and, um, and Patreon members only. <clears throat> so that changed from being $300 to $3,000 to now only investing $40 and turning it into a $6,000 gain. While I was at a break even, I invested that $40. And then throughout that whole entire time, while I saw uh, Terra Luna Classic move so fast, because it did happen really, really quickly that things were moving and went to a massive, uh, massively high level, <clears throat> I ended up uh, having about 28 million here because I took um, about half of what I invested um, or half of the coins that I got back. So I think it was like 40, 40 million or something. So maybe... Um, uh, sixty percent of some of the coins that I invested, uh, because I invested in about sixty three million coins from that forty three dollar transaction to turn it into uh, twenty eight thousand dollars, um, or twenty sorry not twenty eight thousand dollars to turn it into uh, twenty eight million coins that's left, which was worth two thousand five hundred. And I wasn't sure where it was gonna go, but by that time I already profited six thousand dollars off of every move that I had there, which I was really, really excited about, you know, profiting that much. Then I took some of that profit and put it back in there. And that's how I eventually got back up to the 50 million that I have now, 50 plus million that I have now, um, which could be worth so much more in the end. And I made sure that I wanted to have a, a, a lot or a decent amount in order to profit a pretty decent amount in the end. But yeah, that's, that's my journey. Um, I know it's not really like crystal clear, but you can see it. And if you want to go back to the different videos that I had between May 12th or let's say May 11th and May 14th, those videos really explain exactly the progression of where things have gone and how much I have profited and how much I have invested. So I legit turned 40000 or $40 into, um, you know, $30,000. Or if you want to be... Um, you know, kind of anal about it, I guess you can say $340 uh, because of the money that I invested when it was at pennies to make money there as it was growing because it went down to like 0 .00, 0 0.008 and then went back up to about three cents. And that's where you saw a lot of that profit that I took or not profit, but the break even that I took not knowing where it was going to go because they only added, I think it was 3 billion. Then they added another trillion and that's where I started to say, all right, well, maybe I don't want to invest any more into this. But then uh, as I started to see it drop a little bit more, I was like, wait, this could be even more of an opportunity because it's at 0.00000068. Um, and a lot of these exchanges did not report that number because they, they um, suspended trading. And uh, if they suspend trading, they stop tracking the price and the price doesn't show you the lowest point. But if an exchange does show you that, i.e. pancake swap, um, it will give you the best price possible. And I wish I could show that here. And if I find it over on Patreon or I find it um, in my private videos on YouTube, because that's how I streamed back then, 
Um, and I think you still do that now. Um, maybe I can get a breakdown of, of that and give you when I actually bought it. Cause I would love to show you the, uh, going through and buying it. And I was so cautious of, you know, showing people exactly what I was doing. Um, because I didn't know what I was going to show. I didn't know if I was going to show a seed phrase or anything like that. So I just wanted to take you through this journey of, you know, ac actually turning $40 into $30,000, um, you know, in total, but then I guess just looking at that, that full journey is just, uh, something that we can relive over and over again. Um, and uh, I wish the transactions were pretty clear, you know, as if I was swapping from MetaMask to MetaMask, you could see that clear, but it only shows you in BNB when you go through uh, a lot of these breakdowns here. So like if I go into the breakdowns to show, um, you know, when this happened or when um, the last thing happened like this with 3000 Lunic, it doesn't really show you um, the full breakdown as to what actually happened there. So. I'm I'm a little um I wish I had more investigative um experience to try and figure that out but uh yeah I just can't can't figure it out. Anyways guys, um hopefully this clears a little bit up for you. I know there's some people that are kind of skeptical about it but I'm not lying to you guys. I'm not capping like I I literally um have invested $43 or technically $44 with with fees and stuff. Uh, in this position and uh, turned it into thousands of dollars. So I can't wait to tell that story when it's turning it into millions or hundreds of thousands or whatever it ends up being. But I'm so excited to be a part of this story with you guys and for you guys to be a part of my story and for me to be a part of uh, the community story. So anyways, guys, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit that notification bell for more videos like this one. Also, make sure you guys check out some of the links down below. It does help out the channel. And if you guys want to follow me on Patreon, feel free to go and follow me over there. But I'm going to get out of here and I'll catch you guys in the next video.